In this Tinkercad simulation, we will interface the servo motor that is the SG90 servo motor with that of the Arduino Uno. So, for it, we will first select our Arduino like it. And after you have selected the Arduino Uno, you need to take your servo motor by just writing servo in the search box. Here, this is our SG90 servo motor, and we must know that this servo motor can move its shape to any precise angle as according to the programming of the Arduino. So here there are three pins, one is the power, one is the ground and one is the signal pin. Ground must be connected with the ground of the Arduino like this. And power pin must be connected with the 5 volt pin of the Arduino. Like this and okay. Now the signal pin uh, can be connected to any of the GPIOs. So we have connected it with the pin 9. You can connect it with the any other pin which you want. Okay. So now our hardware is completed. Now we will go to the code. Here we have written our code. We will copy it. We will go to the code section and we will just paste it here. So here we are using the servo.h built-in library of the Arduino Uno. So here it is mentioned that pin number 9 is, con uh, is actually the signal pin for the servo motor. Then servo dot attached the uh, servo pin so either it is checking that either it is attached with it is an inbuilt function for the servo motor so it will uh, it will just ensure that pin number nine is connected with that of the servo motor then there are two for loops uh, one is for to rotate the servo motor clockwise and the other is for the anti clockwise movement and the angle first our servo motor will go from 0 to 180 degree and then from 180 degree to the 0 degrees so now we will try to start our simulation and here we will see that our servo motor is moving is according to the programming done inside the Arduino so you can see that its shape is moving properly from 0 to 180 degree and then back from 180 degree to the 0 degree so hopefully you can now make this circuit and test inside your trinker kit software so thanks for watching